Hi everybody, it's Gunny once back. This is the updated version <laughs> of the best gold team to farm. So special shout outs to Abu Bakr who mentioned something I missed. So I'm going to redo that. I'll redo, well, redo it right now and show you how to get 562k instead of the last video which was 500 and well something less, right? So obviously we need to go make some money. And this is why um, this is a fair bit of uh, fair bit of cash because we need money. We need money to upgrade our characters. This you may have heard before if you saw the video. But then again, if you weren't subscribed, then you didn't see that video at all. So this is all new to you. So you make sure you subscribe right now. Don't forget. So here is the gold team. You want to be doing this on Lunatic, of course, and use up your lovely skip tickets. So, the first thing you want to do, it doesn't really matter about the leader, and if you look at some of the character combinations, you can invert them. It doesn't make a difference if I do that. It's going to be the same. Hello, hello. Right. Now, randomly, I'm going to just do that because Sylvie gives you 12 and 6%. Okay. And if I swap that over, it's still going to be 12 and 6%. Good morning. This works the same way. Not for every character pair, but for them it does. Now, previously, we had Chang and Christmas Choi. You had Robert and Yuri. And so if you don't have these characters, try those. It's better than nothing, as we said before. Now, but the new, uh, well, the new character that joins the gold group is Kim. Because Kim with Lolly Kim is going to give you also 12.6%. Awesome stuff. Lots of money. And of course, last but not least, came kind of recently, you should all have her by now. It's uh, Gatecrasher Alice, and with uh, Halloween Chris, uh, you get the Gatecrasher 12.6. So everyone's got 12.6, that's 18%. The next thing to think about is the cards. Now, some people, <coughs> who I shall uh, mention, uh, believe that these cards were a bit of a, uh, what's the word? Um, it was a bait, bait card rush, um, uh, was bait from the card rush event. Uh, it, it is bait, but considering that there's actual reward of money, it's like, well, yeah, it's it's good, it's good bait. The other baits were like messing around with, you know, a bit of damage here and a bit of chill here and a, a bit of iffy, iffy, you know, uh, chance to get a critical here you're like yeah swings and roundabouts this is cold hard cash so 20 percent gold on you know on top of your uh, gold uh, gain uh, that's it you don't need to level these up you don't need to spend your card resources you just sling them in and we're done now uh, so there were actually three sets of these to get if you grinded enough but if you didn't want to well okay you you can use the other sets in fact uh, the other set next to this of this is the hold on a minute here we are hello, hello. is the gate crusher set and this will give you 15 percent so five percent less hey you know it's just gold you don't need gold do you yes you do so you should have used those <laughs> should you use those ap potions to get yourself three sets of uh, that wonderful um baton pass but if you didn't well okay fine we'll just try to make do with these instead that's a good 15 percent you know, better than nothing, right? And after that, you want to go for your option cards. So let's look at the option cards. And the best option cards, standard option cards, which you can normally get, you can put them in your uh, pity uh, from the selector of, of the normal card uh, banner. You can do that. And it's going to be the first one is going to be the real winner, uh, which is a 7% gain. 7%, nice. But after that, the best one is... Uh, the trouble during vacation which is gold gain of 10% so that's a big fat buff and what I didn't do on the last video is I put uh, I didn't put one blue Mary on each character and that's a mistake because remember that you can't duplicate the cards you can't put two of 10% on one person so I was like yeah, yeah. just put I put on two because over here I had actually put the, the new highest option card, which is the 15% from the 
from the Merci Mademoiselle card. And then you and I put some of the anniversary card on the other character or, or next to next to this. And that's not a good idea. You want to have uh, one Blue Mary card per character. Do not put cards on the strikers. You don't need them. They don't count. They don't do anything, which I found out a long time ago and wasted my life away. But um, where's the anniversary card? Right. So you got that one. The Messy Mademoiselle. Uh, yeah, 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 and then it says Sylvie must have it. There it is, the third anniversary card, uh, which is also 15% cash. You don't even need a skill cooldown, it doesn't matter. Just make sure you skill up so that you get the full 10, level 10, so you can get the 15%. Um, right, so I think I've repeated all the stuff from the last video now, so that should be super clear. Um, and shout outs to Rajiv, aka Polo, for. Uh, uh, trying to one up me <laughs> on the gold, and I was like, "Well, hold on." And then, so I got more gold, and then, and then, thanks to Abu, we're like, "Actually, ah, oh, we still messed it up. There's still more gold to get." And yeah, so you know, um, good things happened, right? Cool. So there we are. We're all wailing now. We've got loads and loads of cash. Did I forget anything? We've got the option cards. We've got the set cards. Uh, we've got the characters in place, um, and we should get. Did I forget something? I don't think so. So we should. Oh, oh, oh crap. Whatever. So you should, with all of that, free blue merit free cards, the anniversary cards. Oh, I remember now. Right? You get 562k. Right? 562,000. You're rolling in the cash. But if you don't have the wonderful cards that they just released, um, there are a couple of other option cards you might have, which will do. Um, but really, you should be able to get the Blue Mary card. Just put that in your, uh, you know, your selections, and you'll get that eventually. Um, you know, and also get it from Pity. But um, where is it? Let's see. There are a couple of other cards that you could use if you don't have any money. Uh, let me double check that one. <laughs> now it's just crit damage. That's probably the same. Yeah. Um, Kind of surprised they didn't give us anything from uh, that one. There's the... No, that one's that, yeah. And that one. Yeah, no, it's okay. Right, so it's uh, here. So there's a Blue Mary card. It's this one. This is the first anniversary card, which gives you 5.6. Better than nothing if you haven't got anything else. And then, if you're around at the time of um, Gintama, collab there's one there 5.6 as well <laughs> uh, but like i said don't you don't need to put it on your um don't need to put it on your strikers it won't make any difference uh, that doesn't matter and uh yeah so you can get those from the normal banner so there you go um yeah hope you see hope you can uh, equip this in the right way don't forget uh one blue mary card per, per character and the rest whatever you've got of the special option cards and notice you notice i didn't level up these uh the set cards you don't need to absolutely fine but the other ones the other sets you do need to level up the option cards especially so you can get the full benefit of those and then you can get yourself loads of money mate loads of money wonderful okay wow this is a repeat video and it's still running at nine minutes oh my gosh i'm so sorry but thank you very much for tuning in i hope you get loads of money and have a wonderful new year in 2022 and hopefully think lots of money come real money comes your way take care everybody